Okay, I'm at another one of the testing facilities or testing rooms at Festo. You gotta come in inside and see this one. Okay, inside this special room, they're trying to test the effect of electromagnetic energy on the tools. So you know when you're on your cell phone, sometimes if you go too close to a tower, you can kind of hear a little bit of a, a, a sound in the background. That's electromagnetic energy. And that's all over the world. And so this room is actually built to certain dimensions so that it captures the full wavelength of some of that energy. So they'll bring one of these tools in here in an isolated area where they can isolate out the electromagnetic energy that's outside. And they've got one tower that can shoot that towards the machine. And number one, they're testing what happens to the machine if it's in that environment for a long time. Do the electrical components stop working? Is there a malfunction with the Bluetooth? Is there a problem with the controls? And then the other one is testing how much electromagnetic energy the machine produces by itself. There are a bunch of components inside each of machines and there are international standards that dictate how much electromagnetic activity your machine is allowed to let off. So they can test that to make sure that it's within standards and test it to make sure that it'll always operate no matter what the work environment is. Now I've sped this part up a whole lot just so you can see what's going on, but this test normally takes between one to two hours and that table will spin around and move the tool so it's in different positions and the antenna in the background you can see moving up and down. So it will move into different positions and shoot different wavelengths and different frequencies at the tool so they can test the broad spectrum of wavelengths and electromagnetic activity. And the whole time this test is going on, they're in the other room monitoring everything and watching it on screen as well as watching all the data and the readouts from all all the information that's coming out of the machines on the inside of the room. And what's really cool about this is for most companies, they actually send this out to a third party lab to do. Whereas Festool has gone and built this whole facility so they can do all the testing in-house and control everything in-house. And because they're working with power tools with a lot of different frequencies and they're sending tools to different countries and they have different standards and different rules in different countries. And this way they can control it all in-house.